Communities across Lagos have continued to cry out for help. This time, our community report focuses on Berigbe axis of Ikurudu, and this is what we saw. From roads that have been totally wiped out with flood, communities like this have continued to suffer basic amenities like good roads, drainage system, and of course, the opportunity to move from place to place to conduct their daily businesses. This road is totally wiped out. We can barely ascertain if it ever existed. Residents of the area had this to say about the road and how long they have been going through this menace. Uh, this, this road has been this bad for almost, um, if I'm not wrong, more than a year now. More than a year. And is this the main road that that is Berry Bear that leads to Berry Bear? Yeah, this is the only road that leads to Berry Bear, except so, the one within streets. Except the one. So if your if buses are coming, they don't get to ply this road. So they have to ply the streets. They have to ply the street. Does it make it accessible? Like, is it easy to get the buses, bike? Come here. Uh, we find it difficult to get box or bike around there because you need to get to very good bus stop for you to get the bus. And if you're coming from garage and you're to alight at a wall, you, can, you, can, you won't be able to alight at a wall except you alight at a, a what is it called, at Mowu or at Pipeline because of the bad road. Bad road. Yeah. That's how you feel about the road. Ah. The road is very bad as you can see. The horse will be going, going out and coming back, it's not easy. The road is bad. If you went out in the morning, coming back in the night, you have to take a truck, maybe Panadol, or because of the body pain. Okay. So, that is the little thing I can say about that this. Is the transportation ah, much? It, it, it's much, oh. it's much. Garage. Ah, it's much. If you are going out now, maybe it's 500 or 700. Oh. It doesn't get worse. Back. Coming back, how much? Maybe 1,000. Beribe is a contributor to the GDP of Ikorodu. Beribe is a community that has housed for many years many families and businesses. Beribe has also been a very big link between other communities in Ikorodu axis of Lagos State. However, do we call Beribe the abandoned or the forgotten one? Why? Are they not feeling the direct impact of government in this axis? Which infrastructure do they have? Absolutely none.